How long have you been married? 25 years. 25 years? Yes. Hmm. When you get married as a girl, kutiwa, unyamezele. Hmm. Whether the problem is a triangle, square, or round, si anyamezele. As guys, you are told, ukuti, get married, umdala. As if Ubudala is going to sustain the marriage. Mm-hmm. And unfortunately, uh, Christian guys, most of them, <laughs> they don't have those tactics of preparing a woman for intimacy. Mm. They come because they are ready. Mm. I-, I want to tell you why you men keep quiet. It's because women can be nagging. Mm. Can be nagging. Can be saying one thing over and over again. Maybe the first time you answered Mm. And the second time you did, and the third time you felt okay. You know, as, as, as wives, we continue with what your mothers have done. Huh. And we even fill in the gaps. We even fill in the gaps. Women even fill in the gaps. They will teach you how to chew your food at your age. They will, they will tell you. You want to German thing and straight, yes. It is because most people don't divorce even after divorce. Think I hmm? Please. I need to understand that one. Please. People don't divorce even, even after, after divorce. divorce. With their papers, with, with the whole painful process, traumatic process, you find that there's no divorce. There's no place in the Bible that, that says sex must always be initiated by men. Are we pinned? That camera there. There is no scripture. <laughs> <laughs> Our well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us on the Gospel Reality Podcast. I'm your uncle, your friend, your boy, Brato. And today, we brought somebody all the way, all the way from Matatiel. If you don't know where that is, on the border, you know, Port Edward, that side, on the border of Lesotho, this Bayatet, and then Babuwa Lesotho, Habe, you know. So we've got that person today, and I'm very excited, you know, to build those and strengthen those marriages that we are... Uh, 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 wrestling with as Christians, you know. But before we go any further, if you look behind me, please don't forget to make sure that you bring your CDs and DVDs. A lot of people said I must collect. Uh, even Johnny said, hey, when I was, I will plug you, you know. So it's going to be full by next week, I hope. And our song of the week this week is from Lebos Khovela in Neba. Oh, what a gem. Beautiful song. We were there for the recording as a gospel reality podcast. I think uh, CC Lemos Jovela is doing the most. So please check out Inneba on all digital platforms. Inneba. But don't forget to tell your friends, your family, your uncle, your nephew. Share it. Um, like our com- and comment. Comment and subscribe so that Umbu Sowe Zulu must grow. But ladies and gentlemen, without any further ado, today I've got a dynamite in studio, you know, uh, because we're dealing with marriages and we're dealing... I needed to find somebody who, who's got a teaching background, who can teach us and who has walked the journey and show us this institution of marriage. is And then she says, no, don't worry, man, because I've seen her videos. Hey, she goes straight to the point. <laughs> hey, Ponzo, you remember that uh, those aunties, when you get married, are yeah. <laughs> In daughter, <laughs> yeah, she came and she was firing. I was like, I need to talk to this lady. And just as, as a side note, before I introduce the lady, né, my wife says, When I homo, stop this thing of just talking about what their wives should do. What about the men? Yeah. And guess what? The lady who came today, uh, my misto, my man, did I pronounce it correctly? Makelana. Makelana, yes, as in small group. Makelana, ne? Uh. Hey, <laughs> My Mr. Makelana mm-hmm. is here in studio. Mama, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. How are you, Putty? Hey, you know, I'm, I'm nervous, man. I'm gay. You, are... you know why? I should be nervous. <laughs> no, do you know why I'm nervous, ne? No. Ne? Uh-huh. no mama, ne? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We're going to talk about sex. Uh-huh. 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 <laughs> Mm. And then she says, I must call her Mamisto. Mm-hmm. And mm. I wanted to say, Mama Mamisto. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm in trouble. Eh? Okay. Eh? okay. And when are you comfortable? 
I am comfortable. Really? Because the name my mister was given to me by young people. Ah. Yes. So, and also it's mostly used on the radio and on other yes. platforms, you know. Yes, Mshobo Wenene and other community radios that I've been to. Yes. No, no, no. The Voice of Matat and Alfredo Community Radio. Ne? Yes. So, and, and you were telling me that you, you were a teacher. Yes. What is up? Just tell us mm-hmm. the, the, the process. Yes, there. I was a high school teacher yeah. for 22 years. Yeah. And then I resigned yeah. in 2010. And then I resumed in 2013. Yeah. And then I resigned again, again. in 2022. Yeah. Yes. Um, in 2010, I just resigned because I wanted, it was a personal thing. Mm. But in 2022, I resigned because I wanted, it was a calling. Oh, okay. It was a calling, really. Um, I wanted to, in fact, God revealed to me that I had to start my own Christian school. Ah. As in Exodus chapter 2, verse 9, oh, where the daughter of Pharaoh said to Moses' mother, feed this child for me, I will repay you. Mm-hmm. And then it's in Exodus chapter 2, verse 9. Yeah. And then in Hebrews 11, It comes again where it says, after Moses had grown up, he Mm. refused to be called the son of the daughter of Pharaoh. Mm. He became strong and fearless because of the breastfeeding in Exodus. So I last year I started the school and it's booming now. It's booming. You said you're only doing grade R for now. Last year. Last year. Yes, 2023. And then now? This year it's grade R, one, two, and three. Oh, so it's a... Fully registered, fully fledged school. Fully fledged, eh? registered in the Department of Education and having eight educators. Huh? And seven of them are uh, 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 from the neighbor, they are white. Really? Are from the neighbors, white. Employed by a black woman. <laughs> and it's, it's in the township. Mm. Most schools in Matatel. Matatel is a very mixed up place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That there's a lot of whites, there's a lot of colors, there's a lot of Indians, all of mm. and the, the the schools, all the multiracial schools are in town. Ours is the first uh, is the first school in the township mm. owned by a black woman. I know she's a community builder. Eh? Yes, <gasps> I am. I am a community builder. Ah no 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 yabonagala yabonagala but I mean you know they say uh, in this day and age you don't ask women their age I, wow I'm one person who is never in any platform afraid of how old are you my mister <laughs> I am fifty years old now fifty years I am fifty years old now you know yes, I'm fifty nilando <laughs> nimar Mm-hmm. Because when you got here, I was like, hey, can we help you with makeup? But no, 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 they're right. They're right. And look at her. I think you're looking good. 50. Um, I turned 50 last year. I'll be turning 51 in September. 51? Mm-hmm. No, no, no. So now I'm going to be afraid to ask those questions. And I've got now. five kids. Five kids? In December, five kids. <laughs> I've hey? got five kids. <laughs> Is there more coming? You, you, mean, you never know. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> when I go two, I'm done. I'm done. I'm okay. done. So, you know, what made me say, I need to talk to this lady. Mm-hmm. Besides the videos I've seen on social media, mm-hmm. right? There was a tagline you put, building better marriages. Yes. And I found that so significant that uh, it's, it's like as Christians, we forget that. This institution of marriage, as much as it was given by God, mm-hmm. it needs to be worked on, it needs to be uh, nourished, it needs to be uh, looked after, it needs to be grown, pruned, you know, you need to feed it mm-hmm. for mm-hmm. it to grow. Mm-hmm. 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 And I thought to myself, hey man, uh, more than anything, I'll also be learning here. Mm-hmm. And, and mm-hmm. the nice thing about today is we're, not, we're just not talking about what should women do. Mm-hmm. What should women do mm-hmm. for both? Mm-hmm. So every question I'll be asking you, it needs to be target both, both right? Yes. Now, but before we go there, how long have you been married? 25 years. 25 years? Yes. Hey. People don't get married that long anymore. <laughs> eh? 25? Yes. Sure. We got married in 1998. We'll be turning 26 in September again. 
Ma. Yes. Yeah. My <laughs> goodness. 25 years. Yes. And um, how did you survive the fight? The, you, you are clearly an entrepreneur, right? Mm-hmm. Um, uh, obviously, there are going to be conflicts mm-hmm. in marriage. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And now you're teaching people. I'm guessing mm-hmm. you've been mm-hmm. through those conflicts. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. now you are teaching other people. Mm-hmm. But how did you survive them? Because especially culture. Yes. You know, culture is a way mm. of suppressing mm. women, if mm. I can say it. Mm. Because the, the, the former woman mm-hmm. and the modern woman is not the same. Yes. Their roles have not changed. Mm-hmm. It's only the men's role that has stayed the same. Mm-hmm. He's a provider. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now a woman has to be a provider. Mm-hmm. And then still, sub- please take us through, through okay. that. Uh, um, maybe let me first start by answering your first question, Nuguti. Why am I here? Why am I this in, in this platform mm. of advising people yes. about marriage? Okay. It is because in my journey, I many a times I had to ask myself, Nuguti, why was I never told? Mm. Because I'm not the first person to get married. Mm. People already knew about these things, these harms and hurdles of marriage. But we, especially, maybe if I may say, as blacks, we are never told or taught about marriage. Mm. When you get married as a girl, Mm. whether the problem is a triangle, square, or round, as guys, you are told, Uguti, get married, Mdala, as if Mdala is going to sustain the marriage. Mm. But then, along the way, I realized, Uguti, I should have been told. Mm. Because in one of my first books, a uh, 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 marriage learner's license. Mm. The reason I said it's learner's license is because as a driver, you are never given a driver's license before Elena's license. Mm-hmm. And Elena's license is more important than the driver's license hmm. because it teaches you a road rules. Uh. Road rules. So one of my chapters there is relationship road rules. Hmm. Because the book of Hosea, we're talking to Christians mostly here. Mm-hmm. Now. The book of Hosea, chapter 4, verse 6 says, My people. It's God who's saying that. Mm. My people are perishing, are doomed, are destroyed because of lack of knowledge. knowledge yes. Not because of the devil. Shame. Mm. Hey, my and in most cases, we blame the devil. Mm. But it's lack of knowledge. L- truly lack of knowledge. We need to understand. When you opened this um, session, you said what we should expect or what marriage brings for us. It's more of what, what, what we bring into marriage. Mm. What we bring. In one of the chapters here, I said, bring your baggage, not your garbage. <laughs> your luggage. Bring your luggage to marriage. Mm. Yo, bring your luggage, not your garbage. Hey, what's the difference? The difference is when you are moving away from the old house to a new house, mm. you go out with two bags a garbage, and a luggage. A luggage is what you're going to travel with to the next world of marriage. Mm. A garbage is what you're going to leave at the gate Mm. for the garbage truck to Mm. take away. When I get married as a girl, there are things that I have to leave at home. There are things that I've got to take with me for for, for building my new family. Mm. So... Unfortunately, I'm about to answer your question now. Mm. Unfortunately, we get married with our luggage and our garbage. I'm the the last born and my husband is a first born. So the way we are brought up is so different. So I need to know some of the things I don't have to go to marriage with Mm. because they they will definitely destroy my marriage. This is an arm. Mm. It came with them there. But your question was, how did I survive? There, there are five things, if I may be very quick, mm. is that, that destroy our marriages from us, not the devil, from lack of knowledge. Lack of knowledge. knowledge yeah. Number one, it's perception. 
the way we say things. It's always going to be different. Mm. Married people have got different perceptions. Mm. Uh, my husband likes amasi. I love meat. Oh. Yeah, well, so we are so different. And there's nothing wrong in these things. Ne? Nah, I'm an outgoing person. My husband is a very enclosed person. Mm. And I used to say, in most cases, uh, rabbits usually marry a tortoise. Get what I'm saying? So oh, the, the speed, yeah. the space, you know, there are so many things. Mm. But get, just to be precise in your, in your, in your answer, mm. what has helped me get, is the Lord's guidance, mm. honestly. Mm. The, the guidance of the Holy Spirit. He's ever faithful. But if I answer him, it's very abstract. Yes, it's it very is. abstract. It is. But the Holy Spirit is a teacher. Mm -hmm. He's a helper. He is a helper. But besides that, you know, we need to gather knowledge. We need to teach so that we don't fall into the same pothole. Mm -hmm. Ten cars in one portfolio. In mm -hmm. one portfolio. So now I'm standing as a red tape, mm -hmm. as a red triangle. Mm -hmm. One last thing in answering your question. What I like about the road rules, the tender, I like the road rules, it was the warning signs. Mm -hmm. They say, sharp curve are heard. Did you get what I heard? They are proactive. Mm -hmm. They tell you because, before you get to the sharp curve. But unfortunately, Tina, we are very reactive. Wait for you to get involved into an accident. And then we say, we knew. Mm. We saw you. Your speed was very high. But we never told you. Mm. So I survived through the help of the Holy Spirit. Mm. Because now I came across things head on. Mm. Head on. But w w wherever I fell... Or I nearly fell, I would put a triangle. Mm. I would write it down. I would go to the radio. I would tell the people. And then that's how I grew. survived. That's how I survived. And that's how I decided to share. Ah, I see. So now, there's one aspect I think you do not touch on, you know. Um, mm -hmm. Women, especially black mm -hmm, women, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They, they go through a lot. Mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm, they... Mm -hmm. they it, and you've seen, I've seen a lot of people grooming black women to be wives. Mm -hmm. And, but it seems like men are not really groomed mm -hmm. you know, when, mm -hmm. when, I, when mm -hmm. I started, you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, you look at things like um, uh, in a marriage setup, right? Mm -hmm. Women, uh, and, and when I'm talking to guys, you know, we've got guys on mm. WhatsApp groups, mm -hmm. and we, we've mm -hmm. got these conversations, right? Mm -hmm. And it looks like the, the, the most common conversation, it seems like uh, uh, men got married so they could have regular sex. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Women wanted the marriage, mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. wedding. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now there's a conflict there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now the, the, the wedding is gone. Mm -hmm. and, and as men, they mm -hmm. say, no, oh, guys, soon my mela is sex. Mm -hmm. Your time will come, you'll get married. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But barring but, bonds are unlimited. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and you, see, you get to a marriage and you mm -hmm. realize what a, uh, the, the challenges of marriage mm -hmm. can hinder mm -hmm. the abundance of these things. Mm -hmm. I'll give you an example. Women go through a lot, especially after pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Some of them, their libido drops. Mm -hmm. uh, some of them, they, it seems a woman can't satisfy a man's libido. They can't keep up, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. So I need you to take me through how, as men, we should be dealing mm -hmm. with that situation. Yo, but I'm happy you touched on that. Mm. It's a subject that should be taught often. Mm -hmm. And before marriage, mm. nyani, nyani, nyani. because it's what we should, the, it's the knowledge we should come into marriage with. Mm. Nam, I survived that because I, I you know, uh, let me take the women perspective first. Mm. You say, Kupra, the law is not used to this. Ne? Mm. Even if we do it once a week, mm. 
it's okay. Mm. And the end, when it comes, it comes with the mentality, you go, okay, keys are on me. Of course. This one is mine. Mm. Anytime, anywhere, any day. and the mentality here to as women is mm. that we are Christian women, you know. Mm. We are saints. And, you know, sex is more of a taboo. Mm. Even when you are married, it's like you are, you, you are afraid to be very, very much free. Ugute, I, we are, and all those things. The judgment, the interpretation. Mm. Ugute, why are you so active as if yeah, boy. As if we can, so you're not that free. Uh, you're not that free, and even the sexual drive go women naturally. Naturally, it's very low. Mm. Naturally, just in a kind of going it's very low. It needs to be activated, and unfortunately, a Christian guys, most of them, they don't have they don't have those tactics. Hey, Tingyo, <laughs> They don't have those tactics of preparing a woman for intimacy. Mm. They come because they are ready. Mm. And unfortunately, the woman is not ready. Mm. And life, most Christian women in their early days or early years of their marriage don't enjoy sex. Mm. Because they do it for compliance, not for enjoyment. Hey. Mm. They do it because they have to. And they are afraid to tell their partners, Wuti, and figure on the Pretoria. Hey! <laughs> you know, they are afraid because they are also protecting e- 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 Christian principles. Mm. Yoba, go, e- 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 Your body is e- mine. E- 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 Proverbs 31 woman. Mm. Yabo, they are afraid to go all out. Mm. Let's do it again. Mm. You know? So they even get pregnant. I can't by enjoy hmm. sex. It's, 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 it's something very pity. It, it's on the third year hmm. that it was good. Tetinyani, Gulum Fundis, Gulum Zalwa, and Gulum Brother, Gle Worshipper. Because he's afraid to break another ground. As a funa at Agis, what do you mean? Go figure. I'm honest and it's painful. Hmm. It is painful. Most Christian young women don't enjoy sex, unfortunately. Wow. Then, no problem. it's true that before marriage, at least women are empowered. We are just back on our person and, and those aunties and those, and those gogos. But unfortunately, they rarely touch on sex. Mm-hmm. They tap on sex. Mm. They tap on sex. But men are the least empowered people, unfortunately. Mm. The least empowered people on marriage generally. But well, the advantage is that their, their instincts drive them. Mm. You know, on, on the wedding day, men don't care about any other thing that's there or not there. When are you going home, guys? I need to ah, manage you know, when it, This long program, <laughs> this, all those things. They don't matter to them. Uh, what matters is this. But unfortunately, in the uh, unfortunately, men need to be very much equipped because they are the leads when it comes to sex. Uh, With men, sex is more like on the microwave. One tap, they are ready. Uh-huh. You get what I'm saying? Uh-huh. With women, sex is more of in the deep freezer. They need the whole day to be defrosted. Hey. Imagine that bedroom with a frozen chicken and a man on a fucking knife. Mm. That's, the, that's the situation in most cases. Really? The man is ready with a fucking knife now. Mm. And the woman who I see, mm. but because she's a Christian, she has to she has to comply, unfortunately. Sure. So, hey, didn't get That's a new feel. So, things like um, uh, the prevalence of cheating men in daughter, in daughter, barang, barang, monagas lab, in daughter, isembe. I understand. And when a, f- a woman does not feel worthy or appreciated, 
does that uh, uh, contribute to the frozen chicken as well? A lot. <laughs> because we said men are ready. As we mm. said, kiss lab. Mm. <laughs> Especially okay. after marriage, unfortunately. Mm. Mm. Because the data the boots. Oh my goodness. Yeah, but, but then the other partner is not very much ready or very much mm. aware of shame. Mm. And that's where the teaching, the empowerment comes in. I wish I was told, Uguti, mm. my husband is ready anytime. Mm. I wish I was told before. Because I would say, ah, oh, Mzalwane, we did it on Monday. Mm. Mm. And now we are closing <laughs> the Saturday. Sometimes I'm, I'm, I'm just closing <laughs> deliberately. And sometimes I wouldn't understand him. Mm. Hey, bo, you've been staying for years without it. Why now? Mm. So active. But it's just lack of knowledge. Yeah. And there are critical things. We need to know about men, man can take a color men, because there are so other physical things. Mm. Men need to know about women. Do you know when men are under pressure? When men are under pressure, they need to get it. Mm. Even though we are Shumayel, that's a pressure we are Shumayel. Mm. Before he goes out, he need to get something. You know, you know, you know, you know. Even think. before the podcast. Be- no. uh, 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 uh. I was <laughs> before. Anything that gives pressure, put mm. it. Mm. And believe you me, believe you me, if he gets it, we are flower. Mm. If he doesn't, we are kicker. Huh. It's, 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 it's very much part of him, he empowerment. Mm. It's very much so. And I, 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 now that I'm advising people about it, I always advise women, Uguti, don't always give them when it's convenient to you. Mm. It's, it's, it's better when they want it. Because it, it has got more power, influence, motivation, and all those things that give strength. My bold. But you're contradicting yourself now. Mm-hmm. You say they must give us when we want it. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, we must always know that they are... Not always ready. Thank you very so much. So are you for saying that. they must compromise? No. Thank you very much for that. I was talking to women about men. Yeah. Then I always advise men, Uguti, don't collect the saucer, the spoon, and the cup when the water is boiling. Mm. Keep them ready. Don't prepare your wife when you are ready. Keep your wife in, in, in a situation that, okay, what I usually say, and it we say it, women are frozen. Ne? If you want to cook the chicken in the afternoon, take it out from the fridge in the morning. Okay. So please break down that taking it out. Are yes. we? Are we? Because I need to understand. Are we? Are. As a man, when you, in the morning, when you're about to go out to work, appreciate your wife. Hmm. You are doing it in the morning for the evening. Be the first one to tell your wife that you look nice, you're beautiful, you're stunning. Hmm. Because in the taxi, Ustapa was at Ace, they Baba. And you never said that. Hmm. And you're the one who's going to be having a fucking knife in the evening. Hmm. And then during the day, just a text can do something. Really? You are eating the bars. As a figure with Petriful, a Baba. Hmm. Honestly, so. And then the food he prepares for you. Be a man who appreciates. Mm. Be a man who acknowledges. They emphasize only. Mm. You know, women are beauty conscious. Acknowledge. Mm. Even if it's the nails. Even if it's the hairstyle. Acknowledge. Okay. It boosts your wife's... Uh, it boosts your wife for you. Mm. We are defroster. Mm. Defrosting is a process. Okay. Defrosting is a process. You cannot just say, oh, another thing, one last thing, words. Words, 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 but that, words. Words mean a lot in a woman's life. Ordinary words. Mm. They mean a lot. So those things, they are going to make, they are recharging your wife mm. for you. On air. Yes. When you make a woman 
feel good. When you make a woman feel, you know, women are very simple. When you make a woman feel good, she's ready to pay off. Oh, investment. And cool. So, so it's true that women are attracted to what they hear and we are attracted to what we see. see. Yes. Ah. Is that then why men lie and that's the reason why women wear makeup? Yes. You know, women, even in church, ne? <laughs> women in church are believers. Mm. Even in church? Yeah. They are be- there are more women in church, ne? Yeah. let alone you know, but there are more women in the whole world. Ne? Yeah. But who cries first when the preacher is preaching? It's women. Because they believe in the word. Not only in the word of God, but in the word. Oh, I wish I could do this example. Sometimes you find, oh, good, the woman is educated, learned, and having things. But when you compare the, the level of the husband, it's what this man said. No, man, you're saying something, man. Mm-hmm. You know, I've always thought women, the reason there are so many at, at, at church, mm. they're looking for spiritual upliftment, they were looking for marriage. But you said something. At church, it's the word. So, so they believe the word more than men. More than men. Let me make, you a biblical, make for you a biblical example. Huh. When Jesus was crucified, he had told all his followers, on the third day, I will rise again. And remember, most followers of Jesus were men. The 11 disciples we know were men. But who went to the tomb? It's women. It's women because they believed. Sure. He, he said he would rise. And we're going there. We, we saw how he was brutally killed. But mm. we, we believe Uguti, he's going to rise. And men were hiding they were wherever they were in Galilee. Mm. This is just an example. Now, wow. when the wine went off in the, in the wedding in Cana, mm. who approached Jesus? It's Mary. Mm. Because she believed, Uguti, Jesus can do something. Mm. So women believe, Chonga, women believe. Doesn't matter whoever. Women believe. They've got that element of believing. So treat your wife. Give. If I know, even if you can say it, they say, Uguti, I'm coming your uncle. That woman will remember it in five years to come. Mm. What you said. Things that we have even forgotten. They remember, ne? We, we do. They do. They remember. So, why do then women get so frustrated? Mm-hmm. Oh, but it, I feel I'm answering myself. Because if, if I'm angry, mm-hmm. I feel like I must just keep quiet. Mm-hmm. Thinking if I talk mm-hmm. too much, mm-hmm. I'll say things I can't say. Yeah. But it seems like it frustrates them even more. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But why is that? Like, how do I deal with that situation? It's because they are expecting you to say something. They are expecting you to say something. Mm. And they are expecting you to say something positive, like comforting them, understanding them, uh, feeling pity for them and all those things. And unfortunately, I, I want to tell you why you men keep quiet. It's because women can be nagging. Mm. can be nagging, can be saying one thing over and over again. Maybe the first time you answered mm. and the second time you did and the third time you felt okay. But they still expect you, Uguti, you must say something uh, to show that we are Velana Nam, mm. to show that you are on my side. That's why they keep on doing it. Mm. Mm. How about you must teach women now? You know, if a man says, I'm going to put up that light, mm. there's no need to remind him every four months. He'll, he'll put it up. And, 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 and that's, what, that's how women are. They will remind you. <laughs> Do you know why they will remind you? Yeah. They are meant to parent. Ooh. Parenting is... So, I, I, I parenting here too has no... At some point. Yeah. Unless you grow and you get to know. Ne? Yeah. I parenting here to goes from the children, children. and to the... <laughs> So, I say, I say, because Gus fears for the boy, he, she would say that hmm? over and over again. And she would also do it to you. To you. So my wife's got three kids, mm-hmm. including me. Yes. <laughs> That's a problem. Andy, 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 
Shabba masi yege. It's a topic for another day. Well, I know. Go, go for but, it. But it's always like that. You know, as, as, as wives, we continue with what your mothers have done. Huh. And we even fill in the gaps. We even fill in the gaps. Women even fill in the gaps. They will teach you how to chew your food at your age. They will, they will tell you. They will tell you so many things as a son. So are you, are you telling me sometimes, just to bring it into context, mm -hmm. women have to deal with what our mothers did not do right as well? Exactly. Nyan, nyan, nyan. Nyan, nyan, nyan. <laughs> even, if, even if the husband is older than the, mm. the wife, a woman would continue with that. Like I said, fill in the gaps. The mother didn't teach this. Mm. And the woman would. Nyan, it's so true. And it's so practical. Sure, I've heard you. My goodness, I'm learning, yes? I'm learning. So I need to ask you this, ne? Say, Buzela mm. podcast. So, mm. When we started, I said, a woman's role has changed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, a lot mm -hmm. has stayed the same, but generally it has changed. No? Mm -hmm. In the primitive days, a woman would stay at home, mm -hmm. fix the kids, and but you know, we are mm -hmm. you've got your own hustle and your mm -hmm, own mm -hmm. school you've started. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you can start your business. Mm -hmm. I don't necessarily have to look after you financially. Mm -hmm. You can do it yourself. Mm -hmm. As much as it feels good for me to do mm -hmm. it for you. Mm -hmm. So in all that... Sometimes there's no equation. Time, mm. time is, a, is a big problem. Mm -hmm. a, a busy husband, mm -hmm. a busy wife, mm -hmm. a wife, first, first shift mm -hmm. in the morning, getting mm -hmm. the kids ready for school. Mm -hmm. Second shift, job. job. Mm -hmm. Third shift, it's been hour at night. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's not, sometimes it's not practical. And mm -hmm. I can, you can see it, but okay, mm -hmm. Is Tim a girlfriend mm -hmm. or, or things like uh, a prostitute? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are those things men should be thinking or, or, or having it as to fill in the gap? No. <laughs> no, 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 no. But that's what men are doing. <laughs> I'm answering your question the way you asked it. Yes. Would, uh, is that they should be thinking. Mm. Unfortunately, mm, uh, I'm happy I'm saying this with podcast. Mm. Unfortunately, m when men think, they are thought is final. Mm. But when women think, it's open-ended. Mm. Oh, let me go to Mamus Van Bani to help me, to advise me. So that's what men think of doing when things are not working well at home. Mm. They think Istanbul, they think prostitution, they think girlfriend. Mm. And there's an, they think alternative route. Mm. They don't think, Guti, this road with potholes and so much stuff can be fixed. Mm. You, you, do you get the difference? When they think, oh, this one in a pothole, so don't, let me get another one another mm. road and there is a way of fixing the same road of 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 your relationship okay in this case how through empowerment unfortunately men rarely consult men rarely go to other men for advice they rarely no, we do rarely i'm we saying rarely and 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 if 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 you do in, in most cases you go to the people you go to your inner to your cycle. Yes. You okay, let me put it like this. You do to, you go to your comfort zone. Yeah. You don't go to the fear zone. If fear zone is where it's someone who's gonna tell you what you'd never thought you'd hear, that's gonna change you. Mm. In a cycle, you're gonna you are just updating them. But my wife is doing this But if fear zone go put him, when you go to someone who say, What can I do? In most cases, you go to people that you tell Guti, this is what I'm going to do. That's what, not all men, like I said, rarely. Mm. And you find that men don't really get the advice. comfort zone. There you're updating them. I'm cheating because mm. my wife has no time for me. And when it gets to bed, he's so tired. And it's just, just giving me 
is sex and you're coactive. Yeah, well, a tremendous thing. I'm the one who's active, I'm the one who's doing. Yeah, well, so there's a I know spark. Yeah, well, I know, you know, all those things. So you are updating your inner cycle, but to call them those of this is how you can revive sexual life. You're a child to work because a child sex has to. Needs to be enjoyed, mm. and Sinazo, we've got a book essay by Lileo, no that Magdalene. Mm. It is the mandate of a man in marriage. The mandate. It, it, if fault you go by sex, inga biko enjoyable, kuni no babini isn't the man. The lupin. Mm. It is in the man. Because remember, we <laughs> said earlier on. I, 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 a man is a router. Mm. A woman has got so many apps, sexual apps, but is it dominant? When mm. is it dominant? Is it dominant? Is it inactive? Have you ever seen Kong and Enda when in a router? Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, yes. Update, yes. Mm. Women enjoy sex. And women are energetic, but they need a man who can activate the woman. A woman is complicated. Yes. I'm happy you said that. You need to know the complications. Hmm. Because one person once said, you remember until we had the frost, hmm. but that's like a frozen. That's like a frost deal. That's like a frost deal. That's like a frost deal. But now the whole day it's busy, man. No, it's it's it's, it's so easy. <laughs> mm. It's so easy. You, you don't have to fight the whole day mm. because you did it the first day. One, man, get attention to some bad few. A woman or, or disappointed is never active in bed. You have to fix the disappointment. Nyan, nyan, nyan. Mm. Because I look at your life. Ebanda nabango mama. Sex is in the heart. The lupin. Engos. A woman has got two hearts. Une heart as a north. Abene heart as a south. Mm. When this heart is happy. Automatically, the other heart is beating. Is Kandi doesn't money fix all those things? No, not all. Yeah, I was a Muslim queen, man. Eh? <laughs> money fixes some things, and Gaia's fix. Let me make mm. an example of the two hearts. Eh? Oh, I wish I could make it so so clear to everyone. Put it there. A happy wife is ready to give. Mm. Telling a happy wife is ready to give. Maybe you're gonna up against it. Maybe or the Gulen the show. Maybe that's why prostitutes have got strength mm. to give because the man first gives. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. And then they are ready to give. Mm. Land guaranteed. A happy wife is ready to give. Now make your wife happy. Her own way. Mm. Not all women are flower girls. Uh, uh, you know, not all women are chocolate women. Mm. Not all, you will learn to know about what makes my wife happy. Not all women, but for no culture. Not all women, but study in mm. and make her happy her way. This is what I oh, used to say. Her way. Her way. Not your way. Her way. Mm. No, I don't eat chocolates. Not at all. I don't eat any dairy product. Yeah, it built, it built on. So you cannot make me happy and get chocolate. chocolate. And I'm, uh, uh, I'm not a person of flowers. Mm. Rather give me seedlings. Okay? <laughs> oh. So when you start your wife, you know the right pattern. Mm. And women are simple in Kalugocho. Women are simple. Hey, very complicated, simple. <laughs> <laughs> when you know, yeah, you, you know what I said. I said, know your wife. Mm. You, uh, 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 wife A can be different from wife B. 100%. So what I said in one of my videos, I said, when you want this light to turn on, 
with Bonzo. Do you go straight to the slide? No. Where do you go? You go to the switch. Mm. You turn on the switch, but the light turns on. When you make your wife's heart happy, the light just turns on. But unfortunately, men go straight to the light. And play with the light. Yeah. And it doesn't turn on. Because you missed the switch. Mm. And most men wait until tonight. I mean, until at night. And say, oh, so so light. You're lighting a light. Frozen. In a light, light, because you should have gone to the switch. And again, let me tell you something. All men know this. Hmm. All married men can attest to this. Instead of the light turning on, in all the whole night, for something very petty. Hmm. Of you are discussing something very, very, very petty. Hmm. And good to go in the yaku can go remain switch. Boo! On bike, hike. You know? Okay. So these are the things that men should know. Would yeah. you fix the little things? Mm. Go to the switch. Believe you me. How do you advise women, mm -hmm. married women, to deal with um, men with erectile problems? Because the main switch, because of diet, I mean, alcohol, mm. whatever the reason. Okay. I mean, so she, men, uh, from my observation, mm -hmm. a lot of men, mm -hmm. Uh, uh, st uh, struggling from that, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when you go to a garage, mm -hmm. they'll sell cigarettes, mm -hmm. condoms, mm -hmm. uh, the quick up, what, 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 mm -hmm. those ones. Mm -hmm. So, clearly, there's a mm -hmm. people have seen there's a problem. So, mm -hmm. how do you deal with okay. men or help uh, as mm -hmm. a wife? Mm -hmm. How do you support your men who's mm -hmm. got uh, mm -hmm. men switch issues? Mm -hmm. Number one. Again, it's knowledge. Which knowledge? Sex is not always penetration. Uh, <laughs> sex is is is, is 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 a lot of processes. Yeah. You can enjoy sex without penetration. For instance, <laughs> the intimacy. Yeah. Because you know. Marriage is more of intimacy. That love, that owning each other, that making each other happy, that bond on its own, it gives flavor to your marriage. Mm. We are still far away from the bedroom. But that we know that you and me are one. We make each other happy. We will bring joy to one another. That's, that's that. That's the beginning of intimacy. Okay, go to the bedroom. No erection, but then we can still enjoy a sexual intimacy. How? The foreplay, the touching, the playing, and all those things. The ends are your figure pretoria. But the message is still down. Yes. Like you said, Ugutim, uh, the main switch is down because of more other things. Ne? Mm. But there are ways of enjoying each other. Because when the main switches down, Kunze will be penetrated and it but you can still enjoy the floods. The rivers. The flowing rivers through these processes of playing. You know, what what brings the rain is it's 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 that engagement mm. which is not always through penetration even a most like mm. engagement that engagement of playing touching words and all those things that you're doing together so as a christian woman mm -hmm. or a christian man mm -hmm. is things like toys acceptable from my perspective i'm and call general i'm not mm. talking for everybody mm. for me it's a no. It's a no. For me. So no toys. It's a no. Maybe because um, Eli Niam has never had experience as well. mm. So I've never even entertained the thought of something. So I, I might not. That's uh -huh. why I say 
for me you. and for my perspection. Yeah. Per perspective, e perspective yeah, that my point of view, yeah. it's a no for me. It's true. <laughs> I don't have much to I don't have much no later. I don't have much to talk about. Mm. Let us reserve it for someone else. Someone else, okay. Yes. Cool. And then I've met the uh uh so mm -hmm. I think what happened. I mean uh, when I'm chilling with home, we said Funa I put porn there and we watch it with my wife. Mm -hmm. And then things get happen start happening. Mm -hmm. Is that an alternative? Nalapo personally, I would say, na I believe in the real thing. Mm. Learn how to make yours, mm. yours, yours workable or working. Mm. Learn how do the two of you take you there. Nina no babini. So that it's something practical and something that you enjoy and not seeing other people enjoying. Uh, I, 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 I believe in um, practical exercise. Which how do we? And also I believe in, in I, I don't believe in quick fix. And believe Guti, we do this, we get here. I believe in the process mm. in the elongated joy of this thing. Because it's not about that 15 minutes. It's about your lives, mm. your whole thing. Because if you, and, um, and, and, and I don't believe in a dependent mm. sex. Because if you say, what wakes us up is this. What if ni are situation? You're not in the bedroom now. Because mna, I've seen, ukuti, there are so many instincts mm. that are did that are, that are when you have videos of them. Kuyenzeka, niku situation is very much outside the bedroom. Nifba, our engagement has put us so close to one another that we are ready to do it. Do you get what I'm saying? Ding I pinned. So in other words, you're saying sex should be had anyway. Yes. As married people. Ah. Please. Mna, I believe Uguti sex must never be restricted. Ten years after the chat again. Mm. Never be restricted. To never. The, the joy of sex is when you want it. Mm. Napina? Napina, as long as it's uh, protected and closed and safe. Yeah, mm. we don't even no, of mean course, that. yes. Yeah. Napina, but. Napina, dinyane sile. And then they are called. What did I say that? Hmm. Uba, I'm a Christian, a born again Christian. Hmm. Sex is to be enjoyed. Because if we wait for, let's say, Mshambe, we are yo, so many miles away from home. As a figure, Kaya, the interest, I say, Kogla level. Hmm. And Mshambe, it trigger was there, hmm. not here. It trigger was there, and we felt Uguti high serried. Yo, biblically, it a Bible, magunga liwa. I go to Ute umfaz maganga ali, unless nifumelene that you are praying or in a fasting. Nalapo, you have agreed. Mm. She's not just gonna say, I can take seven days fasting. I didn't know, mm. and I'm ready now. Nah, mm. your scars and there's no place in the Bible that, that says sex must always be initiated by men. Are we pinned that camera there? There is no scripture <laughs> <laughs> because we are liberating the Christian couples. Mm. Is news and we are afraid of them, but they are not even biblical. Mm. And things like lingerie and those yes. things. And 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 let me tell you something, Bo Mama Bam. Your husband, I mean your husband, becomes so excited when you initiate it. Because Galogu, legally, officially, biblically, you are allowed by God to do it. Mm. So you've got a right to initiate your and it becomes so powerful when you are active as a woman. In fact, even if a man can initiate a sex when a woman is inactive, 
10 kilometers, if it's even one meter. Mm. But when a woman is active, As you can. I didn't say on top central, I just say active. Active. Uh -uh. <laughs> believe, <laughs> believe, believe you me. <laughs> Mama, ma, bam. It takes longer and becomes more enjoyable. And one other important thing. Women, in most cases, don't get there. Mm. But when a woman is active, she gets there first. Mm. And then the man follows. Mm. Then it gives women an opportunity to enjoy the ultimate, the ultimate oh. of sex. Mm. Because even women have to. It's painful and then they try to put it. Women start the journey. And the most painful part is that Akaibe Utata Ukanya fig. And Abe Ekalisa Gangangu Mama, a fagi years or six. The man is Stan. Be Mile Clutch Hendrick and break clutch baby. Sure, I think I think we've spoken uh, uh, enough about sex. Sure. Mm -hmm. But uh, do you have a question about sex, Papa? I know. Yeah, you've covered <laughs> yeah. uh, my uh, I wanted to know, um, there's a book by U. Gary Chapman. Mm -hmm. uh, it talks about the five love languages. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, uh, being, e, maybe let me read them out, word of affirmation, mm -hmm. of service, receiving gifts, quality time, and physical touch. Mm. So, um, and I know these days, uh, modern women, mm tend to lean, lean more towards that, you know, that book and what it talks about. Mm -hmm. um, I just want to know from your side, um, have you ever heard about it? And uh, of these five languages that I've read out, is it, um, is it basically aligned to uh, how a woman should be treated, especially... Um, I fully agree with that and beyond. Mm. I fully agree with that and beyond. Remember, women are unique. Mm. You cannot put them in one box. Ne? Mm. And even in the order of those things, you'd find in, in one other woman, the, 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 the first one is the last one. Yeah, mm. bo. Um, receiving gifts, come Quality time is more important than those mm. gifts. Yeah, bon. um, yeah, affirmation, I did say about that. Hey, even if, yeah, bon. So know those, but on top of those, know your woman. Know yours. What type of a woman is she? It does help a lot. I do agree with that. Hmm. I and see. Yeah. May mm. I answer a question, yeah. especially for the, those who are not married yet? Mm. And it affects Christians mostly, mm. painfully so. There are five things that look like love, but that are not love. Mm. Love is the sixth one. And unfortunately, as of Nengas Fundi, we are seriously so. Can you go through them quickly? Yes, 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 yes. The first one is charm. Mm. Charm is more like love, and it's not love. Mm -hmm. You can be charmed by the part of the body. You can be charmed by a talent or a gift. The way this sister worships. Oh, I love this sister. But Ufigba is not a full package. Mm. It was just charm. It's been its crush. Charm is more of what you see. It crush is it's 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 almost related to charm, but it goes with what you hear and don't don't don't. Mm. You can be charmed by the outfit, you can be charmed by the car, you can be charmed by another mm. thing. The third one is last. Mm. The fourth one is very serious. It's written in the Bible, Second Samuel chapter thirteen, infatuation. Mm. Infatuation. It's 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 a desire, great desire. Um, halele, on basaba well, and unfortunately, a lack of knowledge. Yeah, bands are to be May I say it again? Be called. Atumu yamta and yamba well, yamba well. It's eros. Fine. What's the danger of these five things? It's that when we have tasted your laps, we will be impatient to take when we 
Gufuke zonke eza 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 fruits of the flesh. Mm. Be impatient with this girl. She's like zonke zinye zinto because you wanted to go there. Mm. And then when you when you from there when you have quenched your thirst. Mm. You rhyme the language. We can't even understand the language. We're fine. It's like we're from men. Amanze. We are rhyme. It's like we're from men. Infatuation. We take care of it. Yeah. Care of it. Yeah. I'm taking it from the Bible. Ne. Who am known after he has slept with Otamara Wati? Get up and get out immediately. And it and it happens. Yes, and say, Kela. Let me say it. It's so true. It's so serious. It's so painful. Last, mm. It goes with the experience, but But unfortunately, the person does not know. Ukuba, I'm last. I'm infatuated to this person. Akayazi, mm. unless you know, then akayazi by infatuation learn pet. Angam phone, angam phone, angam phone. I come no no no, and I'm phone. Come and I'm phone man, so and I'm phone. Do you see what I'm saying? You know, you know, you know. You never wanted umdu we content and the container. Hmm. Everybody is a content and a container. Hmm. The five I've, I've I've mentioned depend on the container. Hmm. Unfortunately, then we, because when now when now when we chat till when you know that Magdalena doesn't only know the mamisto people know, he knows the mamisto. Hmm. You have heard of his situations, Apo. And the husband would say, Oh, Abamas. <laughs> oh, I Abamas, shame. When you're talking about the container, Yena is talking about the content. content. So the two have to, have to tally mm. the content and the container. The reason Abantu Betty, they for many content, but it thank you. Mm. But it contain the sent. Because mm. you said we we do makeups, we take a lot of time doing it here, doing uh uh-huh. we seem to be Brazilians almost seven thousand. But men are mostly impressed by the content. Oh <laughs> no, I think uh, let's change gears now, ne? Okay. Uponso once asked Puleng March. So Puleng March organization I run I Makoti in Kosini. Wives in the Lord. I think it's a great initiative, but uh, and then Ponzo asked a very important question. Mm-hmm. How far is Ugubege Zela for, for women? Mm-hmm. You know what they say. Baron, Libitalamo said, Keep hard. Umfazu Fela MPN, Bege Zela sis. So, mm-hmm. how far do you take it? How far would you advise um, couples to you know this is too far? What is too far according to you? Okay. Too far is don't beg a zella without knowledge. Mm. Don't beg a zella without counseling. Mm. Don't beg a zella outside Christian principles. Mm. When you see Ugutin, uh, your journey from your departure to your destination is death. Mm. When you see Ugutin, Tzila Ena is going straight to death. You don't beg a zella that. Mm. Find intervention mm. immediately. Once he offered him, Ubonba, this marriage was going, okay, I expected a marriage to be going that way. We're talking about Christian couples, ne? Mm. Now, when people, you know, when people are married, it's true colors is your ne? Now, when you see Uguti, this is not what I expected. My husband is abusive. My, or my wife, can, my partner, let's say mm. that. My partner is abusive. My partner is not open as secrets and don't, 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 don't. Seek intervention immediately. Say, mm, let's ask for, just make it in a, in a very polite way, whether you are going to couples gatherings or can you visit someone who can advise you. Because when you see Uguti, it's advancing. It's advancing. You don't have to pay with your life. You don't have to leave your kids. You don't have, when you see Uguti, it's going to, Death or destruction, not even death, mm. is destroying you because marriage can tear you apart. Mm-hmm. If the intervention doesn't work, then that's where Nebega would dare to stop. Is that divorce? Um, I used to say, take a break to breathe. Mm-hmm. You need a break. 
Mm. You do need a break, M. Chatwin. And in that break, Kulapo Nibona Ukuti, our way is still going to converge as mm -hmm. we have decided to diverge for some time. And the break here could be, let us not stay together. Man can't develop Ethiopia to be separatory. It's a clean break because. Especially if the two of you still believe in your marriage, mm. but you, you conflicts are constant. Mm. So please take a break, because when when, when the conflicts are constant, mm. so do take a break. Then I advise a break. In that break, focus on within, because it takes two to tango. Even if you feel Ugutim, now I've contributed the least. Kodwa, be the first one. Ukulungi saleyako. Mm. Because you'll never know. You know, Abanda Benson does nini. Sometimes, small things can bring flames. Mm. Let me make you an example. If Uponso can come with a petrol all over this room, ne? can the room burn? No. But if I come with a matchstick, mm. I contributed... With the, my contribution was very small. It was a matchstick. Mm. But it is the matchstick that I light that can cause the soul place to burn. Is divorce an option? In, 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 in cases where the marriage is leading to death, mm. there, there are people Buddhi, who are so abusive to the extent that they are prepared to kill. Mm. They are Run away from that person. Run away. And if your way of running away is divorce, you know, if your only way to save your life mm -hmm. or to save your kids or the situation, but if there is still, even if it's 0,1%, mm -hmm. that there are chances that your marriage can still work. Because you're born in German thing and that's straight, yes. Mm -hmm. It is because most people don't divorce even after divorce. Think I Please, I need to understand that one. Please. People don't divorce even, even after, after divorce. divorce. With their papers, with, with the whole painful process, traumatic process, you find that there's no divorce. How? One. When, when people get married, ne? it's like this. When they divorce, parts of the side go to the side. Mm -hmm. It's like you are... Ripping papers that yes, were glued together. Yes, that were put together. That were glued, mm. glued together. There's no way that can, that they can neatly keep a clean separation. Yes, don't, there yeah. is no clean separation. You got me. Mm. Whatever is said about your ex-wife, your ex-wife within you jumps up. Mm. About your ex, you you go with him. Even if you can remarry, you will sometimes when you're talking to your husband. To your current husband, slip the name of your current, uh, hey. previous partner. In Jonga put literally in everything, mm. in your dreams, in your thoughts, in your plans. You would even say John was not doing it like this. Una sasoke papa hache ina. Una li fast, una quick. Hasoka papa. You'd even be tempted to say, "Do like John." So practically, not even biblically, but practically is what you're saying the same as if it rains and water stands here mm -hmm. and then it becomes dry when it rains again will the water stand there is that what you say as long as that pothole is not <laughs> <laughs> it will okay as good as good as good as good as um i think i will be supposed to i think i've got my sex education today so i'm happy so I've seen institutions, right? Mm -hmm. um, they train uh, young girls mm -hmm. to be proper makot, to mm -hmm. be pro proper wives. And um, it seems like we are looking for a different solution, but we still do things the same. Uh, let me tell you what I mean. Mm -hmm. um, the process of lobola and wedding is mm -hmm. still the same. Mm -hmm. you know? A man must pay. Mm -hmm. That gives a man psyche that I pay mm -hmm. so I can do as I please. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the songs we sing, mm -hmm. in the head, what mm -hmm. does it tell us? Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. um, with, with, with the in-laws. Mm -hmm. 
when my wife goes with me at home, mm-hmm. she has to prepare. And, mm-hmm. and, 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 mm-hmm. But the same is mm-hmm. not expected from mm-hmm. from me. Mm-hmm. So there's definitely two standards mm-hmm. with, with mm-hmm. men and women. Mm-hmm. You, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yes. So, um, uh, but women expect things to change. Mm. How do we change this norm? Should we say now this issue of bride price must stop being paid because we expect things from women mm. that are not supposed to be? Mm-hmm. It, or should we just create a new culture? But would you know, pay my lobola, also pay your lobola so that we are all equals now because it seems like we're fighting for for the same position, if mm. I can put it like that. Mm. What's your mm. thoughts around that? That's very true. We even say, Indo, dear Pagan. Straight. And there's nothing that say, Umfaz, mm. Uya. There's a need, if I may use your words, there's a need for a new culture, honestly. Mm. But that is biblical. Mm. Because these things that we are saying are cultural. Mm. No, but the Bible speaks about bright prices as well. But then... The overemphasis is on women. Mm. Yet, First Corinthians, chapter seven, verse thirty-three mm. says, "A married man is worried. I like the word worried yeah. about how he can make her wife happy." Mm. And it says on the same verse, Corinth- uh, First Corinthians, chapter seven, verse thirty-three. Yeah, it's not mm. it's not preached in any church. Mm. Uh-uh. I know you. And it says on the same verse, mm. a married woman is worried. Whereas in your version it says is concerned about how she can please his husband. Mm. That means with God, God is expecting a balance. Mm. If I say yes to you. To, to my husband, to that Magdalena Paikaya, I must be worried. To go to, how can I make? I'm, I'm worried about that. How can I make him happy in all aspects? In all aspects, I don't have to see. He doesn't. Have, he doesn't have to see a wearied wife coming into the bedroom. Wearied. Mm-hmm. He has to be concerned to go to your uncle's I I've got five kids. My first kid, I would. I see her go in. I would hold my second kid, kid on my back. My third kid, mm. you see. But my husband should be concerned. Mm. Uh, yeah, well, then, just then, the I- culture that we need to, or can you get the new culture that we need to have, mm. is a culture of striking balances mm-hmm. in everything that in everything that we do mm. above our above my closer culture. Above the Zulu culture, above that's why it might be biblical. Mm. In all marital situations, if not clang at one, in the it, if I pile, men love your wives. I like the your because yes, by in doing the yenza, a Christian marriage is very trained. He leaders, men leaders in Christianity, shame. They so divide the love for their wives. Ungos mm. of many crumbs mm. of the love. Bigger part, ye machamendin. A machamende is the church members. They can wake up umfundisi anytime. I call umfundisi a fagi kia and You see, mm. after church, umfundis would go there. The the Africa. You talked about quality time, ne? Yeah. It's a rare good Christian leadership or good Christian families. If you need gift in you're gonna be all over. I pick how you figure so zolala. And the Jama so zolala, you still have got other things to discuss. School fees is a boy. Mm. Uniform common man and and those things are ten offs. Mm. When I'm in bedroom, let us not talk about those things. And M Dunongo Mama the realities of life. Uguti, we're gonna wake up in the morning and the situation is there. We need to infuse a lot of Christianity in our daily lives. I used to say mna mna de practicalist. I need a practical Bible. Mm. But how do we do it? How do we do it? It's a queen as a retina such Jerusalem. Mm. I believe those things. How do they affect us now? Mm. So let's employ a culture, a fair 
mm. to the two of us. <laughs> no, I've heard you. I've heard you. I've heard you. I think you've answered me. But um, Karabilo, who, who, who may not. So, um, is is getting married young still a viable option? I'll tell you why. Um, getting married young, the the culture we're talking mm-hmm. about, mm-hmm. the bride prices, especially when you look at the Zulu culture, mm-hmm. remember so and mm-hmm. all those stuff. Mm-hmm. 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 And after that, we've got a new culture now of having a white wedding, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and a lot of women wanted that. Mm-hmm. 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 I, I from, mm-hmm. They want that white dress. They want to be mm-hmm. seen, like mm-hmm. I was saying, and. Uh, people and young couples, they go into uh, in a marriage mm. in debt mm. because mm. Mm. I want to make you mm. happy and mm. I love you as, as mm. a, and then I'll go mm. take these loans and then mean, in my head I'm thinking oh, you married yourself because this loans were part of mm. mm. What's your thought about around that issue? Marriage begins with a capital letter M because it requires maturity. Right. Okay. Marriage is not about the age, the money, the culture, the Christianity. It's about majority. Mm. Two people deciding to take a journey together. Mm-hmm. It's not about money. It's not about selfishness. Unfortunately, some of the things that are done in marriage are unnecessary. Ooh, like? Like a lot of things during the wedding day. Mm. We spend thousands of monies for one day. Mm. I am for, I am for a white wedding. I'm not against. Mm. That chatter, white wedding. Mm. But then, I was working. I was working, and I was bonus. <laughs> That's what I'm going to them. Mm. I paid for a lot of things. The things that I had debts for, when necessary, I was going to use it. Mm-hmm. As Christians, let's see what's necessary and not. Mm. Because some of the things are, 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 have got nothing to do with our Christianity. They are our culture. Initially, Umambes was good and clean because our forefathers had things. They had cows. They had things. It, was, it was so easy. It was so simple. They were doing it from the heart. Uguti, we are giving our in-laws, our new family, mm. what we have from what we have. Mm. Now, it's so expensive because we don't have such things. Sometimes, mm. I used to overemphasize, Uguti, cut your coat according to your cloth. Mm. Nyani, nyani, nyani. Because we won't be there. You know, there are people who start enduring their marriage from day one. Mm-hmm. Day one. They start enjoying. Mm. And for the first five years, Abayas and Dr. Kuku enjoy. Mm. They can go out. They can buy the things they want. I loaned you 20,000 rands. That nobody can go and say, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to decorate. You know, such things. We must be realistic about everything that we are doing. A white dress is not wrong. It's not a sin. It's beautiful. But Limit yourself, I can go this far. Because in most cases, people do those things to, um, to impress other people. Other people. Mm. Nyan, nyan, nyan. And sometimes we don't even recognize, we don't even see other things that we've mm. paid heavily for. As I was born, you know, I've, I've, fortunately for me, Kengoku, I have seen a lot of marriages as a symbol and as a godly. Mm. Wow, upper man, there's a flow, there's a move mm. of the Spirit of God, there's nothing much. Mm. And the Eastern Cape, uh, they are phasing out. Yes, but traditionally, but back on a white wedding, pinna buyo buso bakona da 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 da. But back on a white wedding, then back on a traditional wedding, they are fusing these things in. And the reason marriage went here, like one two weeks back, we couple ending. They just went out and it was so beautiful. beautiful eh? But it must be a choice and an agreement of the two. God, say, if I emphasize the lay finances, mm. don't strangle yourselves. Because you are, you are strangling yourself. So go to get in the course. afternoon. Yes. Yes. You know what? There was a question I told myself. I'm going to 
ask you, né? Mm-hmm. But let me see. So, Hossas mm-hmm. obviously have their own culture, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Over uh, a girl, you know, I'm going to say, yo, I'm going to say, I'm And then, okay. Hossa young ladies, mm-hmm. they say they mm-hmm. will never, ever even date mm-hmm. a guy mm-hmm. who's not circumcised. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because of the culture. Mm-hmm. Let me go biblical on this. Okay. Very much biblical. Mm. And not just circumcised. Yes. In Tabin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But you all look. <laughs> okay, you can answer Culture this one. Uh, is one of the things, one of the great things, one of the great stones that hinder a Christian life. Hmm. Because a culture is diverse. Oba uti kosa, then uza uti zulu, then uza uti sudu, then uza uti ndondon. And a culture, nga luk tagile ndi kakis, is the beliefs that have been handed down by our forefathers. Si kalapone. You know, handed This is Zulu were handed down by Uzulu. This mm. is was handed down by Ukosa, mm. like that. Ne? Now, when you are a Christian, you step up. Mm. We go Genesis chapter 3. Utu Genesis chapter 3. The eternal levels. The eternal go by a go to Angu Satan. That's why I like it. <laughs> okay. It's a quotation by the devil that's mm. written in the Bible. You know, that's the only question. Ekona go question paper ka Satan. Mm. Satan no question a one ka go question paper yake. Mm. You fail it, you get zero. You pass it, you get 100%. Mm. Uthi go effa. Did God say? Uchilo hmm. na uthi. As a Christian, ku question paper yakho ku khona umbuzo i one ka. In whatever you're going to do, did God say? Hmm. If it's a yes, u pasile. We are now stepping on top of the culture. A city, sitting is cause, a sitting is zulu. If it is is cause a city, you are stooping so low. Futige, maybe don't even call yourself a Christian. Call yourself. Uuza utige itige wana tauko uta uti no cause. Because when you when you want to refer to utosa, you are stepping down from the Bible. When you are saying uti no tiki, because. I heard you. So I need to ask you this. When you got married, mm-hmm. we're not, were there no Kosa? So I, I see you're wearing nice Kosa mm-hmm. uh, clothes mm-hmm. now. Mm-hmm. Uh, were there no Kosa cultures uh, and, and traditions that you had to follow? Oh, thank you very much for that question because I'm going to be very honest mm-hmm. and personal. Uh, I got saved at the age of 17 eskolweni mm-hmm. kwa SCM ne mm-hmm. and I got married at the age of 25 so my, my my family at that time were not born again yeah. and they they wanted as nje zinto nasini ngasazenzi but this one yomqomboti mm-hmm. they strongly wanted it Yeah. Fortunately, I was I was I was a public Christian by then. That's mm. ending on Nekakulu. I I humbly requested them. Humbly requested them uba ungenziwa. And don't ever think about the answer was just a yes. Mm. It was it was it was it was an issue. It was an issue, but because I humbled myself and I requested them bavuma. Mm. Bavuma. Because we still have to respect as Christians. Mm. And remember, I still have to get their authority. Of course. And so, I, I, I had to come down and calm down and ask and request and pray for their yes. Hmm. Pray for their yes. So, they agreed. Mm. They eventually agreed. These that were discussing in Obola, but other members were, were, were not happy about it and You know, fuming, mm. without this and that. Mm. And fortunately, as I was working, I grocery and other things, I, I, I contributed a lot. Mm. I, I bought everything. And remember, I said I requested and prayed about it because I wanted them to know my stand. This is where I stand. And I'm, I'm requesting I'm a Christian. Ah, I'm but as a Christian, mm. 
But this is the Jesus, Jesus turned water into wine. Why were you? And we are so like a fool in the drunk, but which are like blah 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 and all those things. Yeah. But that's where the Christian character now features in. Ah, you don't yeah. have to argue. You have to humble yourself. Mm. All right. Even if they had said no, mm. at some at some point I would agree. Okay. But I would know what God knows my motives. So what I have requested. And I've humbled myself. But fortunately, they agreed. So you didn't this thing of uh, getting a lamb, you cut half, you give them half, you take half. You didn't do all those things? No, they didn't do those things. Okay. Those things. Fortunately, I was a very strong man. Oh. <laughs> so we were standing together, mm. supporting we standing together, supporting Uguti. A Lalini. This is the first Christian wedding. Yeah. We have to portray the will of God. Mm. We have we have we have sacrificed a lot of things personally. Not mm. so, <laughs> so even here, yeah. let's let, let's demonstrate. Uguti, one and we never dated. Shame. Singa babagdala. Two. And I'm happy to talk about that. Yes, it's all. And um, John, what is there anything wrong? What do you? How do you know? So now you do. How do you decipher those five things you were talking about? Last infatuation mm-hmm. without um, John. Thank you. Let me first personally tell you how ours was done before I answer yours. Okay. Tina, enjoying yeah, pleasure. So we need to. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, quickly. Tina, we used the trend. Yes, it and it worked. And that church is in the Ngalunga each. Come as I told you, found Val like a Korakens. I told you, it's not a problem for five months. Alexandre and Mzambul. That's great. That's not great. Now, in my church, Umfana would want an umfundis, then umfundis, there's a way one of the process, ne? Then Umfana got yas to tell. Attend the Ella or whatever way I began. Ah, the whole process. Mm. That's how we met. Arranged marriage? Not arranged, but in a middle man. Who ah. arranged to go to Yakuban? No, was the LIN. Fine. After a certain period, I end up on bar. Oh, yellow. Go, yellow. Then, that woman. So, as I get back on there was that process over as a cum. How number took? How put ban? Johnny. So, but then it's true. Quickly. Mm. Love is a living organism. It can grow, it can die. Mm. It's flames, but it dies. Mm. But it ignites. It ignites. It ignites. It ignites. It ignites. But it grows. Because mm. in 25 years, mm. but Like, do you not need to jola? Nijole, Nazan, better, you know? And then get to decipher if this is infatuation, if this is last. If this... I've got an answer already. Um, jola is not a guarantee. You sustain um, child. It's not. How? Umdu is like a book with so many chapters. Mm. And there's new chapters. We have the chitanga boom. Of course. You'll never discover. So I'm told say actor when Santon in Sun I can't take you know? Because I want to impress you. Mm. But um chat is like a tea bag. Eka little man's. It tipek also bag pa white ne trink or nay roy post ne and don't don't. But when you pour boiling water. Now, um, chato is so so realistic that I want to work with Jolie 10 years mm. after two years. But finish, but this is not the right type mm. of a person because um, Jolo is 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 I command the Kabil. Um, Jolo, um, chato is realistic, it's a lifestyle. Um, Jolo, it's a yo, what do I get? I will not guarantee um, Jolo rather than a Jolie. And so, what you go courtship. He didn't do the courtship. No, but no, 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 
Ezi nyizi ndo kuta tuma kala nende zibone 10 years later. Ezi nyizi ndo kumu uzibone 15 years later. Hmm. Yabo, because e, 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 we married ni ya unfolder. Ya unfolder, ya unfolder. There's a lot. E, e, velayo. Yabo, because we're staying together. Morning, evening, night. We are here. You cannot act for 10 years. No, you are, you are absolutely right. Yes. Ne? So now, with the respect of time, mm -hmm. we're supposed to do an hour. Hey, Scotil. So, Pastor Phil was here mm -hmm. and said, men settle where there's peace. Mm -hmm. How true is that? Very true, Shane. Very true. Very true, Shane. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. So, mm -hmm. I need you to try and answer these uh, as brief as you can. Ne? Mm -hmm. Uh, this part because I need to ask you about these ones mm -hmm. uh, for men and women eh? mm -hmm. as quick as we can I'm not quick God's purpose for Umakoti what's God's purpose for Umakoti e God's purpose for Umakoti it's in Genesis chapter 2 it says when U Adam yeah. multiply subdue fill the world uh, is that the two it by bill two is better than one in dot i one chases a thousand ten thousand he doesn't only multiply by giving birth to children he multiplies what's been invested in a man uh, i could invest uh, men on a cd but he ends by three oh man dm up please Ooh, I bet it, I bet it. god's purpose for a man God's purpose for a man is to dominate. Remember, in the mm. Now, there's gold, there's silver, mm. there's vegetation, there's everything. And after God created a man, one man's a partner, so that man, a man would carry out the will of God to the whole world, multiply, replica, in the beginning. Wow. Okay. Roles and responsibilities, Zomakot. We're talking now in the household. Who should, and you can put it together as mm. men, who should wash the dishes, who should do the laundry, who should do the garden, who should cook, who should provide? When a man marries, the two becomes one. Mm. Whoever can do whatever. How's? I'm done. Because if you want me to split it, in Sagwe culture. Mm. So, um, is it okay if Fazi is the one who's paying for the bond? Okay, before that, we have seen each chefs as a good dad. Mm. Chefs get outside the, the family. Yeah. We are going to talk about passion, your cooking. Mm. Who's paying for the bond? The two decide. The two decide. In Mali, Truth, transparency, and trust. Mm. S sit together, plan together, decide together. Wow. I may be, I might be a businesswoman mm. on a scholar side. So I bond with you, puma kum. Umi enuam abe employed and attended. As long as that is going to leave you at peace. As for now, I'm below that. <laughs> do you think me, uh, men, older men, have got a lot to do in grooming younger men for marriage? And at what at what age should the grooming start? Yes, older men have got a role and a responsibility mm. because Today's men have got so much challenges as in mm -hmm. exposure. They are exposed to so many things. Cultures. Remember, older men were only exposed to their culture and to their environment. Mm -hmm. the culture, their environment. So today's men are in, exposed to a lot of things that confuse them. Mm. As men about questioning these and that at a very early age through role modeling. Yeah, mm -hmm. if role modeling. What what you do is 10 times louder than what you say. Hmm. When the time comes for you to sit down with your boy or with your young man, he has already seen and swallowed a lot from you. Wow. Okay. You know what, ne? I have realized that... Uh, and it's like, I'm with this thing, ne? Like, I've got three more pages to ask, but I can see with you. Oh, yeah, we're in trouble. But there's one thing I need to ask you, Right. According to stats, you were talking about it. Mm -hmm. There's, uh, according to ratio, there's more women than men. Mm -hmm. Are there women who were 
predestined not to get married? I believe so. I strongly believe so. Really? Yes. So it's not the man's responsibility to say, no, man, you know what, let me, let me do lessen the bed in uh-huh. and take two. Mm-hmm. So in short, what I'm trying to ask you is your, your honest view on polygamy. Uh, <laughs> hey, you want my honest view yes. or my biblical view? Your honest view. Personal. You can do both, but let's start with your honest view. Hey, um, I, with me, a polygamy is not the way to go. Because it brings more responsibilities for a man. More responsibilities. If, I, if, I'm, if I'm ready for that responsibility. You can be ready, but not able. Hey. Because when men go for responsibilities, there are two things. Marriage is about rights and responsibilities. In most cases, men go for polygamy for rights. Mm. And by better take away responsibilities. So in short, what you're saying is, even though in a marriage, you can look after both families. Thank you very it's much. Fine. It's not only about money. Remember, we need quality time. Oh. Remember, we need affirmation. And I need someone to say something to me. Get peace. Oh. And say, you look good. So when it's only kids, like, you look good. Even tomorrow, I'm missing something from my husband. Ah. There's a lot. There's a lot that is not monetary that a woman needs from a man. When a man, when a woman gets into polygamy, there's a lot of compromise. Ne? There's a lot of compromise. It's either he's getting de- there for two things, the name of the man and the money only, and missing out on the other eight. But even the Bible says, in the last days, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. they will go out and find these men just for the same name, Jay. Yes, and yes, exactly. That's what is happening. That's what I'm mm. saying. Uguti, it could be for the same name mm. only, but is missing out on the other nine. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. It's so true. There's a lot that we need from these men. <clears throat> we need from them. Remember, it said, as for you men, love your wives. I've analyzed love. Mm. There's a lot that we need from men. Mm. Because we are moneyed, today's women are moneyed. They can sustain themselves. Mm. There's a lot that women need from men. So it's not only money. Just money so yeah. when they go for the surname, there are other things that they forfeit. Mm. I won't get these things. Maybe I will have my husband once a month. Mm. But at least as I'm called, as long as I'm called Mrs. Magdalena. Mm. And uh, you would even say, and the and the used to, I don't mind other things. So what's your biblical view then on polygamy? A biblical view, um, my deliberate <laughs> shallow for today, <laughs> because we'll be discussing the tanda and the men love your wife. It doesn't say your wives. The for now. Uh I've heard you. I think you have uh, awakened a lot. But before Zavala, I saw you brought books. Mm-hmm. Can you tell us briefly, besides you being a teacher starting a school, mm-hmm. being a teacher for so many years, mm-hmm. a motivational speaker, an author, mm-hmm. tell us what you do in terms of ministry. You know, Do you have your own church? Do you, do you, we pastor? Do you, what, what do you do? Okay. Man, peddle it directly. I don't have my own church. I'm a church member. Oh, church member. Just an ordinary church member. Okay. And I'm happy with it. All right. Uh, I'm an author. You calling yam, mm. I've realized what you calling yam is going to the people that are rejected those that are in the dump site. Mm. Uh, it's true. You know, I've got a very clear definition of love. Mm. A very clear. I had an advantage. I was born of a very, of, a, of an elderly mother. My mother was 40 and my father was 45. So I was dearly loved and I've got a brother and a sister. So I was more like a sandwich. So I know, I know how love feels 
and how love tastes. Mm. That's why I'm able to talk about love. Yeah, well. yeah. So, man, call us a second. This a not really depend on me, but I'm an author. Yeah. Okay. Maybe you can tell us a bit about the books. Okay. Yeah. Quickly, my first book is Marriage Learner's License. Yeah, when I just catch it, everybody mm. needs it. Um, I'm always out of copies. This is one of the copies of Ndala because it teaches about everything in marriage. Mm. Because in the it's written in this book. It's quite a soccer. See, Jima for 30 days. See, Jima for 90 minutes. Jina, see, Jima for 15 minutes on the wedding day. See, Jima for 70 years. Do you know what they say? Mm-hmm. But uh, marriage is the only institution you get a certificate before you do anything. Before you even start, here's your certificate. Before you start the program, okay, the, the process of marriage, mm-hmm. but in knowledge, you should have it before. Mm. You know? No, but that's what I'm saying. Yes. Books yes. like these. Yes, yes, yes. Get us it's, equipped. It's very much empowering. Yeah. It's about, it has got everything. Renovate, don't relocate. Hmm. Finances a high accident zone. Hmm. There's a lot. But finance a high accident high zone. High accident <laughs> zone. And you know, in, in this book, yeah. we don't only tell you what's happening, we're bringing out answers. Hmm. How do you avoid where there's, an, there's, a, there's a big board hmm. where there's an Uibonu Sekude hmm. and you change to lower gear? How's Tina? Fine, must yeah. And then Leo Makoti. This one, Makoti Marriage Manual. Mm. It talks about Makoti, no mama zala, Umakoti, hey. in Abantuana, Umakoti, personal grooming, roles and responsibilities of Makoti, Umakoti, ne personal grooming. Umakoti, ne personal finances, Umakoti, Angabili Saga, Le Samente, Mien and Wak. Oh, no. There's a lot that we need as women. So we don't have to depend on our husbands, please. Ushaila Nko, what? The, 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 the last one? It's not the last one. There's a fourth one. Yeah. You could copy you, yeah. The mandate of a man in marriage. Tonga, only one title. The mandate one. of a? Of a man. I need that one. In marriage. Let me tell you chapter one, Wutin. Mm. Pausa before becoming busy. Hmm. What does it mean? It pausa, it pie filling station. Mm. You know, when someone is going far, um, when the filling they station. Up, yes. Yes. Oh, yeah, go for chane. Ubangu last in, first out. Mm. But where good day? He gets out, he opens the door, he kicks the wheels, the tires, mm. you know, fill in the water, the inner, everything, going far. House. Bowser, so chata ungazi. Don't. Please, uso paga entlelen, uso paga, uso chumcha dombi. That was the third one. Yeah. The fourth one, it wise wives. Umchato awa kiwango buche. Awa kiwange fika, awa kiwange tigri, awa kiwange mali, awa kiwange wisdom. Proverbs 14, verse 1. Awesome. Single and so, so satisfied. Hey. Don't panic. Don't worry, Tonga. Quickly. Single and sanctified. Huh. Single and satisfied. Single and saturated. Single and separated. Single, steady and stable. Single and set aside. Single and saved. Single and special. Single and sent. Woo. I'm done. How shall I call? So I know my mom is gonna call me. When I'm close on low show. Touch and I'm dialing your sex. But I feel like this is a conversation. We really I once read something eighty. Uh, An old man wanted to talk about sex no fifteen years old. Mm. Son. Mm. I think it was an it, it was a grandson. Mm. So he was afraid to ask again. Mm. Then one day he was in the son, grandson, I want us to talk about sex. And then the grandson said, Grandfather, what do you want to know about sex? <laughs> what do you want to know? <laughs> because there are three types of teaching yeah. formal teaching yeah. that we do at school, informal teaching. There's a lot of informal teaching that's happening mm. around. Right, yeah. Mama, forgive him because he wants the world to know. The truth and the truth shall set you free. Hallelujah. Wow, Mama. Uh, the, my last question to you is um, What would you like to see change in the modern Christian marriage? A uh, more empowerment, openness. Oh, there's one thing I've always been praying for 
I don't want to act my pastor's wife. Mm. Sorry, my pastor's marriage. Mm. I don't want to act. The container must be exactly the same as what the content is. Mm. Please. In, in modern Christian marriages, that is very realistic. In most cases, I want to buy an act. Mm. We become what the church wants to see us. We become what the community wants to see us. Sipuma ekaya sitabene singa tetesane skumbele and then when we get there, could we, could you please pray for us, mamani? Mm. Could you please start pray for us that my God could you please sing for us? It you know that makes the devil happy about our our marriages. Uguti mm. share. I'm a shareholder, glam chat. They've got my things, but I would wish Uguti. That makes each other happy. Mm. Like I said in First Corinthians, each husband must be responsible for making her wife happy. Mm. Or the con- congregants mm. or the people with your vice song mm. Let it begin at, at home. home. No, we really wear clothes that are the same. We really don't, 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 don't. But as long as the two of us are happy, right. it's okay. Ne? Yeah. Wow, that is so beautiful. Um my misto umamo makelana. Did I say it right? Yes, you did. Thank you very much for coming. I, I don't know how humbled I am that you yeah, you came, you came, says I need to fix myself. Gave you 30 minutes, which has long is and ladies and gentlemen, she comes all the way, all the way from uh Matatiel. Drove overnight so she could be here. So you respected us, and then, uh, but we appreciate you. I appreciate your ministry and what you are doing. It's proper. It's what we need to know. I'm a way to move. We were learning. Ponzo, do you have a last question? Okay, it's, it's sorted. Let, let me answer Ponzo even before. Uh, Abus. Yes. Prophet. I would say, young people, sex is worth waiting for. It's worth it. It's worth it. It's worth it. Don't waste your energy. Don't waste your, you know, all that you have. Wait for proper sex. Because when you married and you respected your body and you preserved and you, you kept yourself pure as a sanctuary, it becomes, it joy yayo is prolonged. Hmm. Prolonged in course. Wow. But you know what? As a way of uh, appreciating you, we've got, a, we've got a gift for you. Wow. <laughs> my, my man. We've got a, we've got a, a, a sponsor. What's the most bad thing? It's a sponsor. Wow. Amen. Called Little Tolaka. Mm-hmm. They provide body butter. Mm-hmm. You know, your body must feel right to wow. your husband or wife. You know, mm-hmm. shower gels. So she, we, they have put together a, a package here for you, ne? so that you can enjoy no that as a guy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. shower gel in here, ne? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It gets a ne <laughs> <laughs> So this is from the podcast to, to, to you. Thank Sinti, you so please much. enjoy, ne? Thank you and so much. And I'm still wow. not done with you. So, so the, the podcast has got something called Hot and Cold. Uh-huh. And just shoo, shoo. They remain hot. And just banda, you oh. They remain wow. hot, wow. Uh, cold. Wow. So it's like a modern day flask. Mm-hmm. Born a class. It stylish. is. It is very much. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Very much. Ne? Unique. So this, uh-huh. Unique. So this mm-hmm. is from us to you when you go and preach. I know from here you're going to, to preach in um, Manzim Toti. Mm-hmm. Yes. Kalela Manzab. Pungi Tiako. Ko So please use this. I will. Ne? Surely. So this is from and us I'll to always you. always put it next to me so that whoever takes a picture, uh-uh. Yeah, go on. Yes. Yeah, mm. exposure, say we did it. Mm. But um, we, we really thank you. I really love what you do. Uh, um, you've demystified things that Christians don't want to talk about. Mm-hmm. For, and for that, I salute you. Mm-hmm. Please keep shining. Please keep doing what you're doing. Uh, marriage is an institution we need to protect, and most importantly, the education behind marriage. Well, ladies and gentlemen, if uh, I don't know that, I'm also a little.